Hi friends, today I'm going to show you how to make a DIY spinner. So it's going to end up looking like one of these really cool things, like this. And what you're going to start out with, you can print out two circles like this, or you can use anything to trace like a mug or a cup or anything like that. And then you're going to just draw designs on it. You can draw whatever you want. And you're just going to, I'm going to do it like a circle like this. And then basically whatever colors you want, anything you want, any kind of design you want, you can make a heart, you can make a star, you can make anything that pops into your brain. So like what I'm doing here, I'm just making some circles. Like that. On this side, I'm gonna draw maybe some hearts with my pink first. And it doesn't matter what colors you use, you can use any colors you want. The part that's gonna be really cool is when it spins around, it's gonna make a design and it's gonna be really cool. So I'm only doing a couple here, but if you want, you can do more intricate like this, or like this side I made polka dots. And you can do that as well. So when you're done with your designs, you're gonna take your circles and you're just gonna cut them out like this. And if you're too young to use scissors on your own, please ask a grown up to help you because we don't want anybody to hurt their fingers and be sad. Now what you're gonna do after you cut out both of them, uh, you're gonna take one with some cardboard and you're gonna take a pencil and you're just gonna trace that circle that you colored already so that it's the same size. I don't know if you can see that. You trace it right there. And you're gonna need your grown-ups help again. So we're gonna cut this out. And if you are cutting them out on your own, be very, very careful with the cardboard because cardboard is very, very tricky to cut. Okay, and once you have your cardboard cut, the one piece of cardboard, you're gonna glue your designs and put them on here, on both sets. And once everything is glued on together, you're gonna, this part, definitely have a grown up help with. You can use a pencil, you can use a pen, you can use a scissor. If you knit, you can use knitting needles. Um, if you have an X-Acto knife, you can use one of those. And what you're gonna do is make two circles right in the middle, just like that. And then you're gonna take a string, not too long, because if it's too long, then it, the spin isn't gonna work right. And then when you're done, you stick them through, and then you knot it, and you end up with this. Now to use it, you pull the strings tight, but not too tight, and you're gonna go like this, just shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it in front of you. And then you pull it just like that. And it'll spin. And you can keep going. Make it really, really tight, 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 tight. Just like that. Nice and easy. Happy crafting.